I'm Dasha Patel. I started drawing on Snapchat back in 2013, so it was really new. Snapchat was just like a really comfortable place to experiment creatively, so I sometimes do doodles, it's just like super weird characters or really abstract art. Now I've kind of done other stuff and moved into the advertising space, but as I transitioned into working on Snapchat specifically, I did get a lot more followers just kind of like from the internet and from exposure. And that was really interesting because it feels strange to have gone from like such a private app setting where it's me and my friends and family to sort of like strangers looking at your art. Initially, a big part of the challenge was how far can you push this super primitive little doodle tool to make something really cool and elaborate? A lot of people ask me that and they're like, how do you do this? What's the secret? I'm like, it's literally just patience. Just like being okay, going over a line over and over or like hitting that back tool. I've definitely found myself like on some pieces just spending over an hour or two just like doing these doodles. So yeah, let's, uh, let's take a selfie and just start doodling. Let's try that. Okay, I think this is pretty much done. I find it kind of therapeutic and fun. I think a lot of illustrators, you know, you're just, you settle in and you like don't even notice the time going by. Sometimes you're just like at the airport and you're bored and so you just take that picture and you try to think of something that would be fun to draw or interesting. Other times I think I've, I've seen like art or something on the internet that is really cool and I'll try to kind of take some of that and apply it to a snap. The internet is a, a wild expanse of artistic resources. Sometimes I'll just cruise around on Pinterest or even Instagram, I follow some illustrators there. When I first started doing it, I was kind of copying a lot of cartoon characters and you know just like relatable imagery and then over time I kind of wanted to push it a little further and see if I could come up with a little bit more original or abstract designs. I really enjoy drawing like flowers or things like skulls so kind of just like integrating that into like a human face has been really interesting to explore. My advice would be to just really keep experimenting and take a ton of snaps, use all the creative tools, and just don't be shy about trying new things. 